Hello and welcome to my workshop. In this video, I'm Santa's little big elf. <laughs> Eventually, all those little blocks of wood will become writing instruments. And as you can see, I have my work cut out. I have two full tabs plus whatever it is spilled on the workbench and a few others that I still need to make. I have to put some finishing oil onto these uh, extra pen cases right here. Uh, and the finishing is going to be similar to what we have seen before. It's basically uh, throwing them into the tub and putting the oil that way. Uh, there is no need to create vacuum for the pen cases, so that's why I have my tub right here. So once I finish uh, sanding them, I'll put them in and finish them that way. Over here is the other batch of pen cases that I've done earlier in the week. They're here drying um, because the oil is still fresh and it still feels a little oily to the touch and in addition if the woods are close together and I know I'm just uh, squeezing them up right now to uh, speed up the process uh, but you will see and if I focus the camera properly you will see a little uh, seepage or bleeding if you want to call it that way right around this area here it's a little bit shinier than the rest i think we can see it right now it's a little bit shinier uh, and that's because the oil is still seeping through the pores of the wood and stabilizing so that's why i have them resting right there just so that uh, they're completely dry for next week and i wipe them every single day to uh, clean up any excess that seeps through for next week's video, I will be actually uh, putting this in resin, uh, or technical term is casting it in resin. Now uh, this is the Banksia seed pot from Australia uh, and it does create really unique items and I'll add an image to it. Uh, so you will see the process of me putting this in resin and it's not going to be only this, there is a few other blanks that uh, have quite the porous uh, nature to them. This is a piece of Kuliba, again from Australia, and I will be filling all the voids with the resin, so stay tuned for that video. As you can see, I'll be pretty busy for the next little while and that's a good thing. Uh, the pandemic has caused a lot of uh, havoc for the past 18-19 months and it's good to see things slowly picking up again. And for the holiday season, please consider supporting your small local business. I mean, we love doing what we do and we love sharing it with others. And as you can see from the set of videos that I've posted, everything that I do is done in my workshop. Uh, nothing is bought from around the world for 10 cents and resold here for $100 so that I lay in a bed of profit. <laughs> everything is hard work. And if you need anything, get in touch as soon as you can. There might be some lead time in manufacturing and or sourcing materials. So to be sure that you get your stuff for the holiday season, get in touch as soon as you can. If you like this video, make sure to like, share and subscribe and also hit the notification bell so that you get notified of my future video uploads. Also, follow me on all social media channels and consider supporting me on Patreon. All the links are down in the description.